These are the people. It's easy to be for war, ladies and gentlemen. It's hard being for peace. And these folks are out there, out front, now doing it. I would like to invite all the veterans that are here. Come on up. All the veterans, come on on stage. We have veterans up here from the Second World War, the Korean War, the Gulf Wars, Afghanistan, Vietnam, Cold War. As a Vietnam veteran, how many people have this real sense that we've all seen this before? My God! 3,600. 30,000 wounded. 655,000 Iraqis dead. Oh my God, what have we done? What have we done? But we're trying to stop it, people. God bless you all. I got a feeling I've been here before in a desert in a dirty little war. Young men can die so fast. My God, let's not repeat the past. I got a feeling I've been here before. Try that with us. I got a feeling I've been here before. In a desert, in a dirty little war. Young men can die so fast. My God, let's not repeat the past. I got a feeling I've been here before. Let's hear you. I am the chair of Maine Lawyers for Democracy. We're an organization of about 80 lawyers here in Maine that advocates for impeachment. We believe that impeachment is ultimately about accountability. Impeachment is ultimately about accountability. We have the power. It is our job to choose to use it. Let's hold them accountable. And together, starting here in Kenny Bunkport, let's change history! Bush spied. Cheney lied. Cheney lied. Far too many people have died. Far too many people have died. It's time they were tried. It's, time they were tried. it's impeachment time. The world needs to know that Americans do not support the actions of King George. 21% of Russians have confidence in Bush's international leadership. 32% of Japanese, 7% of Spaniards, 25% of Germans, 10% of Pakistanis, 3% of Turks. We are here to say to the people of the world, we know George W. Bush as well as you do, and we trust him even less. And we are deeply sorry. We are deeply sorry for the death and destruction he has caused, and we are working to impeach Bush and Cheney and remove them from office. You can never talk politics with. Well, you know what? Now is the time. There should not be a day when everybody in this country is not feeling uncomfortable because the uncomfortable truths are making them wince and think we need to act. Today is the first day at the beginning of the end of the Bush regime. We need to work every day from now until the end to make it happen. Thank you. W had us all believe WMD were there. He looked all over Baghdad. He looked under his chair. He knew that if the truth were known, we could never go to war. So he stuck right to his story. Then he lied to us some more. Lock him up! 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 Lock the bastards up and throw him away! Throw Sounds like. This is what democracy looks like.